Spot Hog Picatinny Mount Fast Eddies. We've been waiting a long time to see one of these. Hello and welcome back to the YouTube channel. MFJJ here with PodiumArcher.com. Talking about the Spot Hog Fast Eddy Picatinny Mount. They've been like working on this for a couple of years and just kind of put it off. Didn't didn't know there, if there was going to be a lot of a demand. I think they wanted to see this stay around a little bit longer, to be honest, before they started making sites around it because they were going to have to redesign a whole bunch of stuff to make it fit. But they finally came out with it and they finally actually started shipping them. We do have these on our website in one pin, two pin, and triple stack in 10 thousandths and 19 thousandths and a few left handeds, but mostly right handeds. But let's see how this lines up and looks on this Hoyt, because that's really what it's for. Although they do fit on the new PSEs as well, because they're offering that sort of setup if you want to use it. This was a triple stack version. A lot lighter. If you actually hold up a Fast Eddy XL in comparison to this, there's a ton of weight in the dovetail and the mounting bracket and the mounting hardware. This is still a little bit heavy, because Spot Hog's always heavy. They make it heavy, they make it beefy, they make it durable, but this is a lot lighter than what it was before. So let's see how it lines up and looks on there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. These start at, uh, I want to say $319.99 and uh, I think the triple stack is $379 or something like that. They're on the website right now. We've sold a couple of them already, but not sure how long they'll last, but we do have them up there. There we go. Like I said, a lot less weight. Like if you pick up a Fast Eddie XL and you pick up this, it's way different. go left to right it's gonna to need to come back a little bit looks like we're smack dab in the middle of the adjustment though as far as your left to right is concerned so there's probably more than enough to get this sighted in third times charm there we go oh down she moves Still a ton of adjustment for range as normal, but let's move this over one more, I think, probably. See how it looks. There we go. Now, keep in mind, you can, little hack for you, if you run out of room this direction, you can unbolt this, flip the whole plate over, and move it farther to the right. But that is about where that thing's going to sight in at on that bow, so it does definitely look like there's more than enough. But like I said before, you got two more holes going the other direction if you just flip that plate over. So you'll have no problem getting enough adjustment out of this site to get it to work. And let's see how it levels up. Move this up here. And lock her down. Put a level on there and get the bow level. And Pretty close there. A little bit. Now, spot hogs don't have a, a rail level, so we can't really set that. We can set the head off of the rail. It's off a little bit. But this is the same system they had before. This, this part doesn't change their attachment, so we do know this works well, and it's easy to adjust. And you can tend to get at everything relatively easily, easily unlike some sites when you're trying to adjust them. Let's loosen those. Side screws, it's probably this one. Yeah, there you go. Tighten that one. Alright, let's try tightening the other side and see if that ends up where we want it. Ooh, that light's making it hard for me to see. There we go. Cool. So yeah, definitely gets all level easy and peasy. Same access adjustments for there. Yeah, so it's basically the same site head. They just redesigned the front of it. 
but I can say that if you are running a Hoyt or a pick mount system, this is way lighter. You're gonna drop a lot of weight off. I don't know exactly how many, but it's probably at least three ounces. There's a ton of weight in the dovetail and the mounting bracket and the knob and the hardware where this is really slick and really clean. Uh, can't recommend it enough if you're running a Hoyt or a PSE and you wanna use a spot hog, this is definitely the way to attach it. Like I said, they start at 319. They still come with the extra rings and a sight tape set and a stopping base for moving it and adjusting it. And on the triple stack, still the three individual adjustment pins. So head on over to PodiumArcher.com if you're interested in one of those. If your shop doesn't have it yet, I know we've had these on order for a while, so they're probably not local yet, but they will be at some point, I'm sure, as long as your shop plans on carrying it. But it does only fit on the pick mount systems. It's not interchangeable, so don't make a mistake of buying that thinking you can put it on something else just because it's lighter. And like I said, I want to say they're 319 to 379. If there's other things you're looking at us to review or accessories you want to see, let me know. Uh, reach out down below, comment down below, and we'll reach out to manufacturers and see if they want to send us something to take a look at or use. And Check on over to the Instagram. We have bow giveaways going. We have, I think we've hit two so far. I'm still waiting for the bows to show up before I can actually give them away and we'll start doing bow builds on those, along with a whole lot of other bow builds. So keep following along. Thanks a lot.